Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. The open closed eyes command lets you apply a set of selected eyes to a face within an image where Photoshop elements can recognize eyes within a face. This lets you more easily copy a matching set of eyes from one photo to another to correct closed eyes within a photo. The more similar the two pictures you use are, the better the eye replacement is. Pictures where the person's face is partially obscured will often not work with this command, as Elements is unable to recognize that a face exists within the photo. To use this feature, select Enhance. Open Closed Eyes from the menu bar. If Photoshop Elements recognizes a face in the photo, it shows it within a circle. If there are many faces in the photo, the faces it recognizes will be circled, and the circle in teal is the currently selected face. You can click another circle in the same photo to switch which face you edit if needed. Then use the options at the right side of the Open Closed Eyes dialog box to select the source of eyes for the currently selected face. You can click a face in the Try Sample Eyes list to apply the sample eyes to the selected face. However, you should select a more authentic source set of eyes from existing photos. To select eyes from a photo on your computer, Click the Computer Choice under the Choose From section, select the Photo to Use in the Open dialog box, and then click the Open button in the dialog box. All the faces in the photo then appear in the Click to Apply list. You can then click the set of eyes in this list to use. To add eyes from photos in the Organizer, click the Organizer Choice under the Choose From section to open a Add Photos dialog box. You can filter the photos to show at the right side of this dialog box by using the choices that appear at the left side of this dialog box. Then click the photos to select at the right side of the dialog box. When finished, click the Done button in the Add Photos dialog box. All the faces in the photos then appear in the Click to Apply list. Then click the set of eyes in this list to apply. Alternatively, to use photos in the Photo Bin, click the Photo Bin button under the Choose From section to load faces in those photos into the Click to Apply list, then click to select the set of eyes to use. If needed, you can click the Zoom In and Zoom Out buttons below the photo to change the magnification. You can also click the Before and After Toggle button at the bottom of the window to toggle between the before and after views of the photo. You can click the Reset button at the bottom of the dialog box to reset any changes you have made. When you are happy with the changes you have made, you can click the OK button to apply them. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.